In this reaction, we start out with an ester and we produce a carboxylic acid. And we can remember that an ester is a carboxylic acid derivative, meaning that if we hydrolyze it, which just means to add water, it will become a carboxylic acid once again. So let's go ahead and show how the mechanism works. And I'm going to do the arrows of the mechanism with red pen. So in our first step, the acid will come into play and this oxygen will just deprotonate um, the HCl. Okay, so let's see how that will look. It's going to leave a plus charge on our oxygen. And in our next step, our H2O will come in and it's going to perform a nucleophilic attack on our carbon right here because it's a partial positive charge. So let's go ahead and show that. And the pi electrons in this bond will move up to the oxygen. So now here's what we're left with. I'll go ahead and draw the electrons in. And we're again wanting to make the carboxylic acid. And we're kind of left with the same problem, whereas um, this oxygen has a partial positive charge, but it's okay. Since we just have this all-in solution, um, we can just use water to deprotonate this uh, oxygen right here. Okay, so it's going to be like this. We'll see what this looks like now. Okay, so it's looking a little bit better. Our last step, we just need to make a ketone bond with one of these two and uh, get this leaving group to leave. But uh, OCH3- minus is a very bad leaving group. So we're just going to use this uh, H3O+, plus, which is now produced, to go ahead and just protonate our leaving group. Right. So now we'll see what we're left with. Okay, well now we have a plus charge on our oxygen here. So it's a good leaving group, in other, in other words. Um, this is methanol, so we have right here, and our carboxylic acid right there. So what we're going to do is just take these pi electrons and push them down. This hydrogen would get deprotonated in some way. And our leaving group will leave at this point because it puts five bonds on carbon, and that can't happen. So we're left with our products, our carboxylic acid and our methanol.